What's up? What's popping, YouTube? Hey, y'all see that look, boy? Um, I'm about to show y'all how I created this like cranberry sunset kind of look. I don't know what to call it, but it's cute. It's cute, and that I like popping. Um, so just already did my eyebrows, so I'm starting off with the Morphe palette. I don't know what it's called. Um, I use the orange and that little cranberry color, almost like purplish pink, and I'm gonna use a little bit of yellow. So when I the, what I learned to do with my eyeshadow now just to make it pop is instead of like swiping it like you know swiping or swiping we're gonna stipple it into it so just stab stab all that product into your eyeballs okay and that'll help with making it more vibrant and you see like y'all can see the color way better versus if I was just like swiping it so yes girl y'all welcome for that little tip especially if you're a beginner so yeah I'm just going ahead and stipple all that into my eyeballs just stab my eyeballs a little bit a little bit and then I'm going to take the what I'm taking I'm taking this modern renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I'm taking the color real guard and I'm gonna put that on top of that orange as well just to like you know deepen it a little bit a little bit just for a little bit of emphasis okay And then I'm just taking a little bit of that yellow, you know, to further create that sunset. And now I'm going to take my Wet n Wild um, liquid eyeliner. I normally don't do this on camera, baby, because, child, I can barely do this in real person. Oh, I did want to tell y'all that just because you use tape, that don't mean nothing. People be talking about something. Oh, that's cheating if you're using tape. And you know what they tell you in, in class? Um, I'd rather cheat than repeat, okay? And I'd rather cheat on this eyeliner than to have to do it all over again, honey. Because I ain't got that much symmetry in my life, all right? So just go in clutch with that tape. One and done, okay? One and done. You don't want to have to do nothing twice. And then I'm going to take this ghetto ruby kisses. I don't even know if that's ruby kisses, but some, um, another gold, like, eyeliner that I got from the hair store. And I'm just going to put that on top, boy. Tell off that tape. Don't tell off that skin. And you see, voila. Voila. Magic. Voila. Magic. All right. And then I'm going to just, like, dry that a little bit. Now I'm going in with my Dr. Brent's Luminizer Primer. I got this out of my BoxyCharm box. Don't know what month, but if y'all don't have BoxyCharm, y'all definitely should get on the wave because if you ain't got no money to pay for no makeup, BoxyCharm really helps a sister out, okay? Really helps you out. So I'm just going to put that into my face, and then now I'm pressing the Airspun makeup um, powder into my face to kind of set that because I get real oily. I get real oily, boy. So I gotta like help myself out. Now I'm taking, I don't even know what foundation that is. But I believe that's the Milani 2-in-1 foundation. I really love this foundation. It's a drugstore foundation. It really had me looking real cute, real cute, boy. I'ma just take my beauty blender. My beauty blender was damp. Take a damp beauty blender, help you smooth that on out over your face. And make sure you get a little bit to them edges. Y'all see them little baby edges I got? And now I'm going to take my Tarte Shape Tape um, Concealer. That's in the color tan. I don't like it because it's way too light. But when I went to Ulta, that's what the lady matched me with. And I'm mad because, girl, you're supposed to be the makeup artist. All right? So why you match me with that? And I'm going to just only put, like, a little bit, like, y'all notice I put it a little bit in my corner. Because I'm going to go in with, um... The LA Pro Concealer and Fawn, something that's more my color. And I just wanted it to be a little bright. That's why I put the um the tan first. And then now I'm going in with that darker concealer because I just wanted it to be a little bright. And you just go ahead and use the other side of your beauty blender. Make sure that's wet too, honey. And press that to your face. And you keep on blending so you can't blend no more. Because we don't want no creasage. Dang girl, hurry up and blend. Blend it way too slow. And I also put concealer around my mouth too to enhance my lips a little bit. Alright, now we're gonna go in with that black opal. 
That's the velvet, velvet, I'm sorry, baking powder. This seems to be the only powder that worked for me because I have a lot of high, I have high-end baking powder and, um, like, drugstore. And this one actually works. It doesn't leave me as ashy as other stuff leave me. Or maybe I just don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. But this really works and it's very cheap. Got it from Walmart. 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 Save money, live better. You already know. So I'm just going to put that all the places that I highlighted. And now I'm going to go in with my black opal. I use this, um, this is, I think it's foundation, but I use it to contour. And I think it's called chocolate. I'm not really sure. I'm just contouring my little face. Contour my little face. I low-key like my contour to be a little dark. I don't know, because it'd be real cute, but them cheeks be popping. And once again, this is another brush that I got out of my BoxyCharm box. I've gotten so many brushes from BoxyCharm, like... And you know brushes are expensive, so that's really honestly saving me a lot of money. Twenty dollars for stuff that costs over twenty dollars, child, please. If y'all don't like saving money, then y'all can continue using Ipsy. All right. And then I'm going with that black opal again. My eyes are really, they really cute. I really like. I was not playing around with this look. And now I'm taking my, um, I couldn't show the product because it's all smushed up into little pieces. So I'm just trying to use it as much as I can. But it's like this pure um, bronzing powder and I'm just going to wipe off my, wipe off the powder with that. And I know I'm supposed to use bronzer to bronze, but it's like kind of light so I like it. Now we're gonna go in with our Fenty Beauty Boy, and we're gonna use that as a highlighter, okay? Well, no, we're using that as a blush today, baby. I'm sorry, we're using it as a blush today because that color is really, really pretty. Go ahead and set it, girl. Set your face, girl. I like to um, spray my face before I do my highlighter because I feel like it sticks more. Your highlighter is way more vibrant when you do that. I've tried the whole putting it on your brush, but that's, that jump was stupid. And now I'm taking my Jackie Ina, my Jackie Ina highlighter in La Peach. And I'm going ahead and highlight, girl. I'm going to go ahead and highlight. That highlighter real bomb, boy. Jackie Ina did not come to play. That highlighter was a bomb. That's like definitely my go-to highlighter. If I'm trying to, you know, shake stuff up, if I'm trying to make the, sh the sun real jealous, that LeBron, I mean, Le Peach is like my go-to, definitely. So we're just gonna go ahead and highlight. I love highlighting my lips too, that jump is pretty. So all the colors that I did use on my eyes previously, I'm going to use that underneath my eye as well. And I'm using it in the same order that I used it in on the top of my eye. And now I'm going in with the color Primavera off of that Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. And I'm just going to put that in the inner corner of my eye because that's pretty as well, boy. 
I don't like doing the inner corner eye all the time, but you know when you need to do it, it's cute. It's real cute. Make you look real snappy. And honestly, that is the end of this tutorial, boy. Now we looking popping. Now we looking good. Okay, girl. Come through with the box braid. All right. Uh, make sure you guys do like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure y'all keep supporting the culture all 2018. The A team. I love y'all. I love y'all. Keep supporting. Hey, we out, boy. We out. Hey.